Imagine that you're lying in your bed, and you're waking up, and you're not making any noise. You look around, and there are no people that you work with. You look outside, and the streets littered with cars. You're thinking this is to be a joke, but instead you discover, you're the last guy on the earth. You'll never know if you're the last person on earth, because you might be in London and another person could be in New York. So anyways, get a nice safe and lovely house, because a lot of things can happen. A man can live without food for six weeks, but with no water for just six days. With everyone gone, no power, and no maintenance, the pumping stations, which would soon stop working to provide water to the taps. There would be a significant quantity of fresh water contained in domestic reservoirs, but this would be soon spoil. Food and drink would not be a concern, but fresh food would be off the menu, after a couple of days, unless you could grow, and collect crops, and fish or hunt. Now for the scenarios. A whole host of things will happen. First, only people have gone missing, but not animals. Dogs and cats and other animals will starve to death, if they do not get out of their homes. Bigger dogs will form packs, and kill other smaller dogs. Animals are likely to run from zoos, and this is basically where the guns comes in handy. There are nuclear power stations all over the world. And once their automated safety mechanisms, began to malfunction without human intervention, meltdowns would occur around the globe, leaving many regions practically uninhabitable. As for your health, the lack of any other individuals to transmit infectious diseases would be a blessing, but the possibility of injuries would be a constant concern. Even a broken limb might easily prove fatal, if the injury is not treated correctly. You will face a much greater challenge in the years to come, such as hunger, thirst, radiation, or even disease. When everyone dies, there will be nobody to take care of the planet, and many things will happen. Roads are going to grow, trees, buildings are going to break, and lastly dams are going to break, and areas are going to flood. This is why you want a house on a hill. When you pass, and pollution stop, the world will come to peace and the cycle will start again.